you study when it comes to Big Bang cosmology, when it comes to the whole creation of the universe, understand that without the Big Bang, there is no evolution. Without the Big Bang heliocentric, you know, universe, when it came to gravity, that everything, you know, has to orbit around the sun and gravity is what makes, you know, everything exist. Understand that without that entire narrative, there is no evolution. It started out as a big theory. Now it's pretty much accepted as fact. And if you talk about anything else, it's a heresy. And they know the biggest problem with that is how can you have something come from nothing? So now you have these scientists that start talking really nutty. Like the biggest problem with cosmology today is nothing. You've heard that probably. Essentially, you can get a universe from nothing without any supernatural shenanigans. That basically, by quantum mechanics and the laws of physics we understand in principle, an entire universe with 100 billion galaxies, each containing 100 billion stars, can come from nothing because its total energy could be zero. And therefore, you don't need to, to literally violate any laws of physics to create a universe. And no, we don't know that for certain. But even that possibility is amazing. And, and I find it worth celebrating the fact that we can probe such things and, and we shouldn't be afraid of a universe that maybe has no purpose because we create our own purpose and our own purpose adds more meaning to our lives it means our brief moment in the sun matters because that's the only moment we have uh, 